it's Gina. Welcome back. I've got some more journal entries to share with you guys today. I couldn't believe it. The postman came and it was like, he said, you've been busy, haven't you? <laughs> so yeah, I got quite a few in today. So I may have to break this up into a couple of um, videos, but let me just start with entry number 32, which is Heidi McGregor. And Heidi has got a YouTube channel on here. I'm going to put her link in the description box below. I did not even know Heidi was going to participate. I have admired um, Heidi's work for some time. She probably thinks I'm like this creepy stalker, but um, I'm not. I'm not creepy, but I do absolutely love her work. And so when I saw that a package arrived from her, I couldn't believe it. Um, yeah, she's very sneaky. <laughs> um, so she's written me a little note here, and I couldn't. Oh gosh, where to start? Heidi, you didn't need to do to do all of this, but it will absolutely be used. Look at the the items she's she sent me. Oh, that that fabric that she wrapped the the entry up in that. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh, that is that is some vintage fabric. Beautiful. Oh, Heidi, thank you so much. And look at the fibers. Those are gorgeous colors and the totally, totally my colors. So let me sit this over here first. She bundled me up. Look at this. It's just beautiful. I hate to even take it apart, but I, I, because I'm terrible at tying things back. I get these packages all beautifully uh, presented and then I take them apart and they never look the same. <laughs> but look at this. She really did spoil me. I've got the bumblebee napkin. How beautiful is that? And look at that one. That is gorgeous. Really pretty. Heidi, thank you so much. It's really kind of you to share these with me. Beautiful. Oh my goodness, look at that one. For an autumn journal, isn't that beautiful? Oh, I love it. That's a beautiful one as well. Very pretty. Look at those. Gosh, they're beautiful. Heidi, thank you so much. And look at these little cutouts. Aren't those gorgeous? Oh, it's just beautiful. Heidi, thank you. That is really, really generous of you to have done this. I appreciate it so much. Okay, guys, let me sit that over and show you her entry. Um... I'm just so excited. I just can't believe it because I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't even know she was going to participate. <laughs> so let me sit that over. And as I said, she had this wrapped with some more of this beautiful fabric. And then she's wrapped it in the um, old sewing pattern. So I love that because I can reuse that as well. But look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? Sorry guys, Daisy's really grumbly today. I don't know what's what's up with her. She must be having a bad day because she's just been kind of going off from time to time at the door and there's nobody there. But look at this. Um, so this is, I know this is Artie Mays. I can tell by the design. Beautiful. And it's the turquoise color. You know I love that. Look at the buttons. She's sewn all of those on there. She is... Um, God, she collages just beautiful. You guys have to check her channel out. And look at the texturing back there. And then the die cut, the um, tool, and then some more little snippets there. Just beautiful. So let's go inside. Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, that is beautiful pocket there. And then look at this. She's got that clipped to there. Oh, isn't that nice? Look at that. She's t she's coffee dyed that um, glassine envelope. And she's got the little layaway tag in there. The little snippet that is just adorable. That button is precious. 
And then this is um, one of Artie Mae's journal cards. And she stamped inside that, inked it, and then that's been clipped over that. That is beautiful. And that's been tucked in to that pocket. Look at that fabric. An old piece of, um, it's got some, it's like linen. And oh, she's slow, oh my God, she's slow stitched around that. She loves to slow stitch. And um, <laughs> one weekend away, I thought, oh, I'm going to have a go at it. But I won't even show you guys my attempt at it. But that's beautiful. It's a really soft blue um, and it looks like embroidery thread there. Isn't that beautiful? Oh gosh, I really wish you guys could feel all of these entries because everybody works on different um, types of papers and they're just all so different. It's amazing to me how different that they, they've all ended up being. And look at that. That's an old piece of um, ledger paper. That's been tucked in there. And then this, she's, that's beautiful. She's got a journal card in here. Oh, there's two, two journal cards. Oh, that's beautiful. That's tucked into a pocket here that flips over. And then look at this. All of the um, different layers. It's just got such a beautiful feel to it. This is it. This is the way she works. Um, a lot of textures and different types of materials. Um, just gorgeous. And this, I can't believe. Look at that. 1919. Gosh, that would have been a lot of money back then. 56 pounds. Huh. Look at that. That's beautiful. Journal cards. They're so pretty. Look at this. She's done all of this back here. It's got some gesso. She's inked it. She stamped it. Um, and then there's like a sheen. So there's some kind of glimmer mist or something maybe. That's beautiful. Really pretty. Heidi, thank you. Yeah, I was just so surprised. Um, today at all of the entries I got. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to be making like a four journal, four or five journals, I think, to fill it. But I'm not complaining. <laughs> Look at that. That's very old trim there. And then she's she's added that to the ticket, stapled that. And that's even been, you know the, um, oh, look at that. This, this is her stamp. It's one of those impression stamps, um, and it's got Heidi McGregor on there. I love that. And then an old ticket there. That's a genuine ticket, too. East Yorkshire. Oh, isn't that nice? Gosh, and look at the collaging there. The button, lots of trims. Oh man, look at that. 1909, that is just beautiful. Heidi, thank you. I am just blown away. This has been decoupaged. She's got some, the, I don't know if that's like a, maybe that's like a glimmer paste or something. That's beautiful. Beautiful tag. Look at that. Everything's just so pretty. And that's an altered guest check. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, Heidi, it is absolutely amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, so that is Heidi. And the next one, this comes from New Hampshire. And this is from Deborah Brown. Now, I don't think Deborah's got a channel. I, I will recheck. But look at this entry. As she said this was the porch print um, papers. But look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? That opens up. 
and she's got journal card inside each of those. Beautiful, and I love the closure. She's got the Velcro there, and on the back, look at this journal card. Beautiful with that charm. This is gorgeous, and look at the collaging she's done here. Trim, it's beautiful. I just uh, cannot believe um, everybody's entries have just been so amazing. I've loved each of them for, for very different reasons, you know, but all of them. Um, it's going to be an amazing journal. I cannot wait to, for this to come together. So, yeah, so this was Deborah's little note there. And then inside here, this is a flip over from, um, you get these guest checks from My Porch Prints. And look at the tab. Isn't that beautiful? And then she's made all of these beautiful journal cards. Just gorgeous images. Beautiful butterfly there. Some lace. I love that. And that flips over so I could do some writing there if I need. And then another, look at that trim. That's gorgeous. And then she sent me a, um, a beautiful letter here um, telling me, you know, about how she made this, the inspiration, what she enjoys doing. And it's this is what I love, you know, is getting to know each of you. So on this side, look at that. That flips open. And then here, we've got another flip up. And then these were a couple of extra pieces of... Um, they're either coffee dyed or tea dyed paper. It kind of looks like... Uh, I don't know. It's pretty dark. It's probably coffee dyed, but isn't it beautiful? flips over and then look at on the back here she's got beautiful papers and then in this tuck spot she's got this little writing tag tucked in there and then another these images are so pretty so so pretty and then I love that beautiful Oh, Deborah, thank you. That is a really, really beautiful entry, and I appreciate it so much. I'll tuck your little card back in there. And I'm going to sit this over here, guys. I don't want to get these mixed up. Now, the next, next one is coming from <clears throat> California. This is Vicki Connerty. And look at this. She sent me a beautiful card. She's written to me, and look at that lace that she sent. Vicki, thank you. you honestly, you, you did not need to, to do this, but I love it. <laughs> Beautiful old trims. Look at those butterflies. Oh, I've got to get those out. Wow. Oh, aren't those fabulous? Look at those. Beautiful. Vicki, this is just uh, amazing. The trims and uh, those butterflies are gorgeous. <laughs> she, I know she said she likes to, um, to do a lot of different crafts. Look at that. That's beautiful. Um, and you can see... That's gorgeous. Thank you so much, uh, Vicki. That will certainly be used. Absolutely. It's this she had wrapped up really, really nice. But look at that page. Isn't that beautiful? So this is all backed with um, a piece of, it feels like, like a, a muslin material. And then look at this journal card. Isn't that beautiful? Love that. And then this. Look at 
had a little note in the, and then she stenciled inside of that little envelope. She's put a little faux wax seal. Let me just check the time, guys. Okay, we're good. And look at that old postage, postage stamp there. That is gorgeous. And that's been tucked into that pocket. And then we open up and look at this. She's got one of these beautiful lacy cut pockets. I love those. And then she's pinned this um, flower applique here so I can take that and use that elsewhere if I wanted to. But I like it. Beautiful papers. Beautiful journal card that she's made. She's fussy cut that. <clears throat> that is so pretty. And then she's backed that with some beautiful tea dyed paper. Look at that. That's an old piece of um, wallpaper. And she's backed that. So you, you, it, she's made it a journal card of it. Isn't that clever? Oh, gorgeous wallpaper. Beautiful, and that's in a glassine bag, and then this old stamp, and another little, isn't that paper gorgeous, look at that, I love it. This is beautiful. And she stamped on there for you, and it's got a little butterfly as well. Beautiful. Okay, over here, oh, look at this. Another piece of that old wallpaper. So she's made a, a tuck spot back here. And then look at this. Another, a double tuck spot there with the laces. Look at that. And that image is beautiful. And then a tiny little envelope. And I'll try to get this out. I do struggle with these, but look at that. <laughs> that is so sweet. So I've got a little secret place to write there. Beautiful. And then she's got an altered paper clip here with a pearl and some old lace. And then she's got her Handmade for You from Vicki C. 2020. Beautiful. And look at this. She's got another one of the handmade there. Look at that. That is beautiful. That's a beautiful border there. And she's created a little tuck spot there. And then inside of that, look at that. That is beautiful. That flips over. The paper, I don't even know what kind of paper that is. I was trying to figure it out when I looked at it earlier. I don't know. It's just so pretty because it's been embossed. But maybe she embossed it, and then she's got a journal card tucked in there. It is gorgeous. Vicki, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. This is beautiful, and I appreciate the extra bits of um, laces. That wasn't necessarily necessary, but it's very much appreciated. Thank you. Okay, guys, let me take a break, and then we will come back, and I'll do the last two. Okay, guys, this is entry number 35, and this is from Dina Cook. Dina sent me a beautiful little card um, it, telling me a bit about herself, and um, i got to show you the card. It's so gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? So thank you, Dina, for taking the time to do that. I'm going to tuck that in the pocket uh, when once the journal is all created. And she sent me these this little bag here I couldn't believe it look at that it's those um it's that stampin up punch that we cannot get our hands on she's cut me out several of the tabs from that so Dina thank you so much I was so excited when I saw those I mean I was excited about the charms too but it was like oh it's so hard to get your hands on that punch but look at this she's also given me such a beautiful assortment of um, of charms. I can't believe that. And I was getting so low. So this, oh, and they're all bees and little uh, dragonflies. How gorgeous are those? Butterfly. I love the little bells because I'm getting low on those as well. 
that came at the perfect time. Thank you, Dina, so, so much for that. So that was tucked in here. And then she had this beautifully wrapped. Everybody's done such a great job with their presentation. Um, this is the Tim Holtz uh, tissue paper, so I can certainly make use of that as well. That's the great thing about junk journal is we can use everything, can't we? <laughs> Look at her entry. Now you know this speaks to me for sure. That is just gorgeous. Look at that bumblebee with the red tailed. Isn't he gorgeous? Just beautiful. Let me see this. That's clipped over, but look at that image. That's the Edith Holden book page. And then she has this beautiful tag. I love that. She's got fabric there. That's clipped over. With And then that paper clip's got the little bee charm. Beautiful. So that's tucked there. Oh, don't want to tear it. Hang on, let me get my big, big fingers here. Okay, so that's tucked there. And look at that. I love the color of that seam binding. That is beautiful. So that flips over. And then here, she's done another beautiful collaged tag. And that's tucked on this one. Look at that. One of the um, metal plates. She's done collaging with um, Edith Holden book page and some other book page there. This is gorgeous. Really, really pretty. I love this page. She's got another tiny bee charm here. <laughs> gorgeous. Look at how tiny that is. I love this. And look at all of the beautiful little elements that she's got tucked in here. Just gorgeous. I love it. And then back here, oh, I like how she's done that. Look at that. She's got that little butterfly hanging from that tag. That's beautiful. And that sari silk is gorgeous. Really pretty. And another tag. Loving that seam binding. That's tucked in there. And then over here, oh, look at this. Oh, and she's got her name, the date. Love it. Look at that tuck spot she's made there. Isn't that beautiful? And all of those fibers. And then this. Oh, that's so sweet. She's just got that tucked in there. Is it? Yeah. Oh, I see. This opens up. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is really clever, Dina. I might have to give that a try. That is really cute. For some extra journaling space, that's a great idea for a tag. Love that. And then here she's got a couple more tags tucked in here. Look at that. She's got two big tuck spots. I love how that looks. And, and she's kept the bees. Yay! <laughs> Beautiful rick rack there. And then look at this. This is a nice big journal card. And inside that she's got more. It's like a eco-dyed um, butterfly cutout. Beautiful tags. Love these. That's nice. That's that looks like that's a that is a genuine layaway. Oh, that's I love that. I don't have any of those layaway um, tickets, but that's gorgeous. These are beautiful. Just beautiful. Okay, whoops, sorry, let's see. That actually went in here. Look at that image from the Edith Holden in that gorgeous. Gosh, I mean, I just can't believe. I've got the most talented subscribers ever. <laughs> I'm convinced of it. I've got the best subscribers ever. <laughs> and she did some stitching. Oh, no, that's on the tag. Okay, yeah, that's beautiful, though. So, yes, I am just so impressed with what everybody is, has done. Dina, thank you. That is absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous page. Okay, guys, let me set that over and then this one came. 
I was just about holding it together, guys, just about. And then this one came. And this is Rachel, who is Roxy Creations. And, um, yeah, by the time I got to this one, I was feeling a very um, emotional. Um, I couldn't believe it. Uh, Rachel, you outdid yourself, and I'm just stunned. She sent me the most beautiful birthday message. Um, and <clears throat> what she's included for me, I just can't believe. I'll show you guys. <laughs> uh, so yes, I've been praying I can get through this without getting choked up. Um, amazing. Just an amazing assortment of things to play with. Um, she, you know, you always see when she's been out, she, I think she likes to go to the markets and she must have access to a lot of old things um, in Italy. But look at this. I'm sure you guys all know uh, Rachel, but she lives in Italy and um, from time to time she might have things that she can sell in her shop for um, for junk journals. Hang on, let me just get that. I don't want to tear that. And, oh gosh, I mean, you talk about old stuff. Look at this. Uh, Rachel, I just don't even know where to begin. Just amazing. Beautiful, beautiful book pages. I mean, all, I'm assuming, I, could, it's, I don't speak in a foreign language. I think that looks like it might be German, but <clears throat> I'm assuming these are mostly Italian. Her living in Italy, but and I don't have any of those, so I'm like, what? Oh, Rachel, they are amazing. Look at these. And the feel of them, I can't even begin to explain to you guys. I, oh, gosh, that is just gorgeous, gorgeous. Rachel, thank you. <laughs> I just can't believe it. Look at that. Eighteen seventy-six. I assume that's the date. Goodness, that's beautiful. I just, uh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm speechless. I'm absolutely speechless over this. So we've got the book pages, and then look at this bundle of fabrics that she's. Let me cut that. She's got some good tape, I'll tell you that. That tape I use, it would never hold like that. <laughs> Look at these old linens. Look at that, she stamped that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, the presentation's amazing. Oh, I hate to even take it apart, but... I will use it, Rachel, I promise you that. I, I'm not one for having things just sitting around. <clears throat> I, oh, gosh, it's beautiful. Look at the old linens. and Just beautiful. She's very talented at sewing. And um, I first... <clears throat> The first thing I ever got, well, I, I, I bought one of her patterns for the little, um, she does like a little cosmetic type bag, and I kind of went back and forth with her because I, I do not sew. You guys know I don't. I mean, I say I sew, but I don't. And um, I got her pattern, and I did, I did finally get it, um, but boy, I had a heck of a time, and it wasn't to do with her pat. Her instructions are amazing. It was me. Not, you know, because I tend to jump ahead. You give me a set of instructions, and I think, oh, I know what I'm doing. So I jump ahead, and I ended up with the first one. Everything was upside down, but I still kept it because I loved it. But look at this. Goodness, that bundle of 
laces and doilies. Ah, beautiful. <laughs> Gosh, that's amazing. Rachel, thank you. Just so delicate. Oh my God, look at that one. Oh, look at that. I got, I'm, gonna have to, I'm sorry, I'm going to have to be stingy with these. These are going to have to stay for my journal. <laughs> they are so, so beautiful. Sit those over. I just want you guys to see all of them. I wish you could touch them. I really do. Beautiful. These are so old. Look at that. That one's really pretty too. Look at that. I'm sure she knows, you know, that what the names and the types of laces. I'm not that knowledgeable. I just know what I like and I like this. <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful. Gosh, Rachel's, you gave me so much. Honestly, I can't believe this. What an amazing birthday gift. Look at that doily. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to keep that <clears throat> Rachel in my house because um <clears throat> I got a china hutch back home and it's in storage right now, but I've got shelves where I keep my bone china. So that little doily is going to go in it and every time Get that teacup out. I'm going to think of you. <laughs> Just beautiful. Uh, okay, guys, let's get to this <laughs> page. I could just ooh and ah over that all day. And I will. When this is over, I'll be touching all that stuff and looking through it. So here is Rachel's entry, and uh, again, her presentation is just beautiful. I'm going to try to undo this without messing it up. Beautiful. Look at that. So pretty. Her collaging, you know, you see it on on the channel and you just can't until you've got it in your hands beautiful and I think this must be that straw um, she has straw bags in her shop and she's written me a beautiful note <clears throat> so let me see if I can undo this tape I don't want to tear this doily in that doily. There we go. Look at that. That is beautiful. Beautiful. Gosh, I'm so excited to get inside of it. <laughs> oh, this must be the straw. Okay, now she does. Uh, I believe she still has it. She, she can correct me if I'm wrong. I believe she's got the straw paper as well. I know she does the straw bags, but I did, I, at one time she had the straw paper. Now, she may be out of stock of that, but guys, it feels so nice. Really, really nice paper. Thank you, Rachel. I'm going to use that as well. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Look at this. So this is the... She's got it tied with sorry silk. It's beautiful. Okay, so I've been trying to avoid seeing this on her channel, but I finally, you know, I, I just gave in the other day, and I said, oh, I can't resist anymore. So I've had a peek at it, but I have to tell you, it's nothing like having it in your hands. This little booklet, I want you guys to see up close. Look at that detail. Her stitching is amazing. Look at the little fabric tuck spot. Beautiful doily. 
Oh, her papers. Just amazing. The history that she must have. I mean, there's a lot of history here too, but I mean, to have, to be able to go to the market and find this kind of stuff, because I'll be honest, I really struggle even here going around. Just beautiful on that collaging on that. It's gorgeous. She got paper and fabric bits. Just so pretty. Oh, she's backed it with that. Oh, Rachel. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So look at this. So you've got some of the beautiful trims up there. This she stitched. Gorgeous. Oh, God. All the laces. That flips over. So you got a place to write here. And inside, look at that tag. Beautiful place to write. That collaging, that's all been fussy cut. You've got paper, lace, the trim that, you know, was showing through. Just beautiful. And then over here, beautiful lace pocket. Look at that journal card. Isn't that gorgeous? And this has all been collaged back here. Again, more bits, you know, laces, papers, more fabric. That is so pretty and backed with that. I think that's the straw paper. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Oh, look at that collaging. I want you guys to see all that. So much texture. And then a little scrappy notepad. That's beautiful. Gosh, that paper's gorgeous. Old ledger paper there. More of her collaging. Oh, to see it in person. I can't believe it. <laughs> and then look at that beautiful journal card there. That, that's been tucked in. And again, on the back, look at that. Beautiful. Oh, okay, guys. Rachel, thank you, thank you, thank you, everybody. That um, was just amazing today. I've got um, so, so many beautiful entries here, guys. Let me get everything together so you can have another peek. We're still okay on time. Get all of these out. <clears throat> That also very different, but just beautiful. I'll get, zoom out a little bit more so you can see. Beautiful. Thank you all so very much. It is appreciated, and good luck to each of you in the draw. Thank you. I'll see you guys again very soon. Bye.